Hello everyone, my name is Rakesh Kumar. I'm the clinical specialist physiotherapist working in Betsy Cadaval, the University Health Board, Bangor, North Wales. About half of the physical decline associated with aging may be due to lack of physical activities. Without regular exercises, people over the age of 50 years can experience a range of health problems, including reduced muscle mass, strength and physical endurance, reduced coordination and balance, reduced joint flexibility and mobility, reduced cardiovascular and respiratory functions. All of these negatively impact by increasing the blood pressure, which can increase older adults' risk of developing cardiovascular disease or stroke. Researchers suggest that mostly older people do not engage in physical activities or exercises. We need to see how to motivate them to do more physical exercises to improve their physical well-being. I came to an idea using digital technology, how we, how we can incentivize and encourage all the patients to do physical exercises which can help them to improve their muscle strength and their balance. Paddle exercises are known to strengthen 5 out of 7 main lower limb muscles or hand cranks used for the arm and upper body. To use paddle exercises, users need self-motivation or prompting by the professionals or their family members. It is not easy to self-motivate an older adult until they see any direct results instantly. This digital bike is a massive innovation using modern safe and proven technology of USB powered read and push button Google Street View. This device which allows a user to paddle with both their feet, hand or just feet which is linked to a used visual screen that is powered by Google Map. The user can then travel to their old street, cities, destination they would like to visit. Each cycle of the paddling activate the enter button of the computer or laptop or smartphone to move the view of the Google Street or any recorded video which encourages the users to push more to see more views. This self-encouraging equipment motivates the user to push more thus user do more physical exercises. It is an easy setup to use or a store or easy to maneuver. It is very cost effective as modification will cost approximately 25 pounds. It can be adopted to an individual patient for their best clinical outcome. For example, somebody needs it for upper body, you can use it for upper, hand, upper body or somebody for lower limbs so they can stand in lower limb muscles. The same technology can be applied to a treadmill. I have managed to produce a prototype with the help of uh, Mr. Simon Jones, who's an, a technician. He made my dream come true by putting his technical knowledge to make a device which really works. Possible production in future are adopted new exercise bike, wired and fit out of the box bike and ready to ride. Range of bikes, standard, recumbent, single foot or hand crank. This is designed to attach uh, to pre-owned exercise bikes, loom the size of to fit the standard bikes, recumbent bikes or single foot or hand cranks. Cheaper option to recycle, use or unused exercise bikes. We have used this prototype with my few of my patients 
and their experience was great. In this video you can see one of my colleagues is using it. With the movement of his feet, the street we was moving. My future plan is to develop varieties of bikes suitable for different needy people uh, working on the same principle. Uh, other future plans are um, additional testing to assess the user's experience, IT assistance to allow the physical product to link up with any TV or screen monitor. Also to conduct a formal study to know the effect on users muscles and the habit of using this bike without any encouragement. I hope this new device will help the older adults or people who cannot do ex physical exercises outdoor or unable to do exercises in, in, in a standing position. Any question on this project feel free to drop me an email. Thank you very much for listening.